So, understandably, there's a feud going on between the black taxis or the black cabs and Uber drivers in London. I've lived in London, so I know the city very well, and I happen to drive in Los Angeles. I'm one of the top rated uh, drivers in Los Angeles with a 4.94 to 4.96 average out of five stars. The top drivers here, 4.88. I'm sure you know your your star rating. Now, um, this feud that's going on, we we follow it here in the media. I read, I, I, I watch a lot of the YouTube videos and the bottom line is that the industry is changing. So anyone that is making threats and I've, I've had threats from uh, these taxi drivers, it's easy. I just report them to the head office in San Francisco. They follow up with threats because I'm one of the top Uber partners. Uh, you know, some of our drivers make two and a half thousand dollars per week and we have multiple cars driving So we make uber a lot of money. They listen to us and one thing uh, we do not tolerate is threats by other uber drivers Whether it's jealousy or you know, the bottom line is it's a free market You know Airbnb came out of course the hotel starts screaming um, Uber comes out Lyft comes out of course the taxi starts screaming um, Amazon is an online shopping cart. If you have products, get your products on Amazon. Stop bitching and moaning about Amazon. That will actually help you make more money. So if you embrace technology like Uber instead of fighting it, you know, when you are taking revenge or fighting something, you're basically automatically uh, digging two graves. One for the person you're attacking, one for the person which is yourself. It's not worth it, ladies and gentlemen. It's not worth losing uh, an hour or a minute of sleep over this issue black taxi drivers embrace it or change you can go and join uber if you want to or just be better than anyone else you know um, a lot of my business is done with referrals i drive the top nba players i drive many hollywood stars many musicians guns and roses foo fighters and it's, it's, it's really how you conduct business and treat other people, you know. Uh, people always um, love the fact that I have different essential oils online. Tea tree, I mean, in the car. Tea tree, eucalyptus, peppermint. The car always smells like a spa. It has waters on board. It has peppermints on board. I have condoms on board. I have headache tablets on board. I have, you basically need it. I have it on board, okay. Even wet wipes for little kids napkins you name it it's there i keep the car clean on the inside keep the car clean on the outside dress well know when to shut up know when to talk and give the person the very very best service so when you want to join go underneath uh, this video there's a link join under my name you will get half of my referral fee and i will teach you all the ins, uh, ins and outs you send me a message ask me and I will gladly train you. I love sharing. I love giving my knowledge. I have um, over 2,000 trips. And I'm told by Uber that I'm one of the highest rated drivers in the country. Um, any person making threats, any other Uber drivers or taxi drivers making threats to this YouTube, I act instantly. I go straight to, you, uh, uh, to YouTube. I subpoena the records. I go to uh, San Francisco to the headquarters and I find out who the people are because these people do not deserve to drive with such a company. We want to keep it a stellar reputation and want the top drivers out there being positive, giving the company a good name, not bitching towards other drivers. Okay, I hope I made myself very clear there. I, help, I look forward to helping you uh, join as a driver and I'll also show you how to make commissions using the internet to your advantage. Have a great day.